Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to upgrade your Lenovo IdeaPad Flex 5 from Windows 10 to Windows 11 using the Windows 11 installation assistant. The first thing we're going to do is check whether we can do uh, an upgrade from Windows 10 to Windows 11. If you go to Windows Update, there is a little section here that says this PC can run Windows 11. So that's a good sign already. But let's go further and do a, a Windows 11 health check. In order to do that, just click on that link, go to the website and have a quick read of the system requirements. If you can't be bothered reading the system requirements, there is a tool to check for the compatibility. So download the PC Health Check app. Once that's downloaded, you can run it. Double click on the file that was downloaded. You start the tool. Just click next and then finish and launch it. The tool will now check to see whether it meets all the Windows 11 requirements. So click on check now. And yes, it does. You see the green tick. That means you can do the upgrade to Windows 11. So once the requirements are checked, the next thing to do is to go to the Microsoft website and do a search for Windows 11 download. Click enter. Select the first result and then click on Windows 11 Installation Assistant. Click on Download Now. Once it's downloaded, run it. And now let, let the Windows 11 Assistant do its thing. So the first step is to download the whole Windows 11 installation files. So I'm just going to speed this up. The whole process took about 50 minutes to upgrade the Windows 10 to Windows 11. So I'm just going to speed this whole process up, but I'll guide you through the different steps. So let this step one complete. Once you hit 100%, then you'll move on to step two. For step two, it actually verifies the download files. Once that hits also 100%, you, the installer will move to step 3, which is the installation phase. This process takes a while, so I've also sped this up. And once it hits 100%, it will restart automatically. So let it restart. Or you can press the restart now. This will mean that you have to manually close everything and restart it. So let's close that down, close the window, and restart it. The laptop will now restart. As you can see, it's putting up with the Lenovo logo. Now it's it's installing the updates. Just give it some time. It's now logged into Windows 11. As you can see, the interface looks very different. The icons and start menu is actually in the middle of the taskbar. Let's have a look at some of the features. One of the features that I like is the ability to position the windows. It's got different options now where you can position the in different locations of the screen. So let me give you an example. If you hover over the minimize and maximize button, you see that you can actually snap the window into the different locations. So I'm just going to put one in each corner. Let me open up another window and now I'll put this on the bottom left hand corner. Just close this down. You just need to hover over that button and then select the location. 
So in this example, I've got four windows and they're positioned at each corner of the window. And if this video helped you in any way, give it a like and subscribe to the channel.